Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. All right, I can finally record because I'm not as grumpy as I've been the last couple of days since Monday when juicing has begun. <laughs> guys, I have been so grumpy and just grouchy and just not having it, just not feeling it. I was like, I have to, you have to record today. You have to record, give an update or something. I guess this is the harder part about not having any social media so that if I don't upload, I'll find a way to reach you guys. But this is my only real source of social media. As I have been so grumpy and I don't, I don't believe it's because of the juicing. I don't know if I told you guys this, but I cut my coffee while juicing. So no coffee. And I think from my body detoxing from the caffeine, it has really made me grumpy. Like I didn't even want to record speaking honestly. The very first day I felt a bit, like I had less energy. I felt a little on the weaker, so not like weak and just like, you know, what is life? But I felt like, I don't know, wait, my energy was just down. Going into the second day, my energy was down. I just got enough energy today. Today's the third day of juicing. I've been sticking to it. I'm gonna really see if I could pull through these next two days because this morning I had a scare. Now, every morning I make my son pancakes. That's He just loves it in the morning. That's the only thing I can get him to eat in the morning. He just loves them. Um, and so, like, I'm, I'm okay with making his pancakes and then making my eggs and breakfast eggs for my husband. Like, I'm okay with getting breakfast out the way, even though the breakfast plating is different from mine. So anyway, these pancakes. These pancakes I've been making... And they, you know, it doesn't give me a problem. It doesn't make me want to eat them or binge or, you know, I'm okay with my eggs, toast, and coffee and I'm good to go. This morning, like any other breakfast morning, well, no, not really because I didn't have my coffee. I didn't have my eggs. I miss eggs so much. As soon as I poured the batter in, immediately... I don't know what came over me. I just, my mouth just watered for these pancakes. I smelt the cinnamon and the vanilla extract. Like I smelt everything in this pancake mix. And the pan, like I was scared for a moment. Like I had to back up because that was just a setup for a binge right there. And I started to question the juice. Am I doing too much? Should I just knock it out with three days and you know leave it at that if i can't make it to the fifth day but i pulled through for the rest of the day i drank my my juices throughout the rest of the day and i pulled through uh but that was a scare this morning i will be honest with you now my very first day my very first juice um monday morning it took me about that whole day to kind of figure out exactly what I wanted to do because this is my first time juicing. So I needed to know like what blends of uh, the sweeteners, the fruits I would use and so on and so on. The very first one was so sour. Like I forgot how sour grapefruit is. And I added a half a lemon, a cup and a half of kale. Um, I think I had like three strawberries because I knew it was the grapefruit was a little sour, but I forgot how sour. Maybe it was just my batch. Like, I don't know. It was so sour. And uh, and then it was the lemon. I should have maybe done cucumber or something else, a, a different juice base besides lemon because it, it was so sour. So I drank half of it. I thought I can drink it that sour. It was so sour that it overpowered the spinach. And I couldn't take it anymore. So then I added a half of banana and that kind of like bring it together a little bit. Uh, it was still sour, but not as sour. So I knew that the next morning I would do the same thing without the banana um, and no lemon. Or I did use lemon juice. I squeezed the lemon, but it was like very little. And that was it was perfect with the grapefruit in the morning, the next morning. I also found out Tuesday that I like kale and pineapples together so good i would have never known so i did a hat a cup and a half of kale well today i did two cups of kale with pineapples all right so but tuesday i know i'm all over the place guys but tuesday i did a half a cup a cup and a half of kale with one cup of pineapples a squeeze of lemon 
ice and water. And I realized that it was so good and I could have lived off that the entire juicing, but I still wanna give my body variety. So I did something else last night for dinner, I believe. I'm kind of getting it all confusing with stuff. And I wrote my journal. I wrote everything down in my journal because I wanted to document it. Don't ask where it is. So I have to think off the top of my head. Okay, and so today I did a strawberry, banana, and kale, which is okay. A lot of people who juice, that's their kind of go-to, but I really enjoy the pineapple, guys. The, the cup and a half of kale whip, a cup of pineapples, ice, water, and a uh, splash of lemon juice. It was so good, so good. So yeah, guys, that's basically it. That's just my update. The first day I was kind of like weak feeling. I felt kind of weak, and then the second day it was better than Monday but still a little weak. But today, uh, my third day, which is Wednesday, I feel I feel good, um, except that scare from this morning with the pancake. Uh, so yeah, I, I haven't felt hungry because with the water and the juicing, it really fills your belly up. But I've today I felt I needed a solid. Like I needed not an actual salad, but a solid. Like I needed something solid in my stomach uh something whole not juice and and uh i don't know so i'm i'm gonna wake up i'm gonna do my juice and go on as normal uh but we'll see saturday in saturday's way in you guys will get the last uh you guys will get the juice update so i'll mix those two videos together so i'll do my juice results you guys will find out if i made it another two days or not um and then my weigh-in so um yeah for everyone who has decided to juice with me, I hope it is going well. I hope you have found a nice juice blend, kind of like your, your go-to um, that you enjoy. Because I, I guess if you find that, it kind of gets a little easier. I hope you are sticking to it. If you have made it to day three, congratulations, because I don't know if I'm going to continue. <laughs> I'm going to try, but guys it's this is rough thank you for the support i know in my last video you guys were very encouraging and saying i could get through it. i hope i can get through it you know but i definitely made it three days and hopefully that will show more than just half a pound this week because that's why i've been averaging at half a pound so we'll see we'll see if I can at least lose two, two and a half pounds, two pounds, two and a half pounds, I'd be happy. I'd feel it'd be worth it. But we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. All right, guys. So thank you so much for the support. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for liking. Thank you for sharing. Thank you for commenting, guys. I'll say it every video. It means so much. I will see you Saturday for juice results and weigh-in. Bye.